Hello everybody, in this video we're going to take a look at yet another way that we can create textures for our uh, 3D, 3D models in Maya. So I'm going to select my character here and I'm going to open up the UV editor. Now I have already done the UV unwrapping and mapping for my character. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go to image UV snapshot and I will open that up. I'm going to make a couple changes to this. I'm going to change the dimensions from 512 512 to 2048 by 2048. This will give me a bigger resolution um, map that I can work with. Uh, and I'm going to tell it where to save it to. Make sure that you know where you are saving your UV snapshot. And I will save it. Hit apply to finish. And that should be that. Now I can open up this UV snapshot in another uh, piece of software, such as Photoshop, or in this case, I'm going to use Paint. Now, I haven't ever really used Paint before, uh, but I'd just like to experiment and explore with it and see what I can do with it. So here I've opened up my UV snapshot in Microsoft Paint. Before actually starting to paint my texture, I did need to play around with this tool for about 10 or 15 minutes to see what it's capable of. My reason for trying out this tool is that many of you probably don't have Photoshop, while paint comes standard with most PCs. The main takeaway of this video, however, should be that you can take a UV snapshot in Maya and bring the snapshot into a 2D paint program to paint your textures. And since the intention of this video is not to teach you how to use Microsoft Paint, I will be speeding up the video at this point. Now that I've finished painting my texture, I'll save it. And I'll return to Maya where I will apply this texture, this image, as the color texture of my material. In Maya, I'll go to my Hypershade, create a new material and I'll apply my image to the color channel. And here is my textured character. And here is my cast of misfit superheroes. 
To create these textures, we've looked at some tools within Maya, such as the 3D Paint tool. We've explored different solutions for UV unwrapping. And we've looked at how we can export out a UV snapshot and bring it into another piece of software to paint a 2D texture. I hope you've enjoyed this video and thanks for watching.